Hello Capricorn, welcome to a you and them love reading. We're going to be looking at what is going on in your connection at this time between you and the person you are thinking about or connecting with. And then we're going to look at the energies between the both of you. So as always, these are general love readings, so they will not resonate with every Capricorn watching. So take what resonates for you, what applies to you, and leave the rest. You can also check out your other placements your moon, your rising sign, or any other sign of significance. All of the playlists are, okay, we have the Knight of Pentacles. All of the playlists for each sign are linked in the description box. All right, so let's jump right in for Capricorn spirits, angels, guides, messages, please, guidance for Capricorn regarding love. So we're going to look at what's going on in your connection first. What's going on for Capricorn? in love okay i think that is the king queen of pentacles what else so i'm just going to turn around what else for capricorn what else we need to know the king of swords what's going on for capricorn in love going on in this connection between Capricorn and this person Knight of Swords so there's some sort of a communication happening here between you and this person some sort of honest and open communication now the Knight of Swords tends to be kind of they just kind of rush in and say what they got to say um, sometimes they can be blunt sometimes they can be a bit harsh uh, sometimes the truth can come in very swiftly quickly you could be dealing with the air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or uh, another earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Tell me about this Knight of Swords. What's this Knight of Swords about? Five of Wands, Reverse. Two of Pentacles, Reverse. So I think that this is some sort of communication to overcome a problem or conflict with the Five of Wands reverse. Two of Pentacles reverse is telling me someone could have made a choice about something and now they want to tell you. The High Priestess is at the bottom of the deck here. So someone here could have been keeping something to themselves or and now they want to tell you. Um, but I'm getting more like someone just wants to be clear with you. Like they want to tell you, hey, I've decided this is what I want. This is what I want to do. Can I get one more for the Knight of Swords? This could be like through text. Tell me about the Knight of Swords. The Ace of Cups. Yeah, I feel like this is definitely somebody that, you know, they're coming in and I feel it's like they're coming in so that they could tell you, this is what I want. Um, this is how I feel. And I feel like this is this is being done in the hopes of fixing a problem. Can I get one more for what's going on for Capricorn in this connection between Capricorn and the person? What else do we need to know about this connection? Five of Swords reverse, yeah. So there's been conflict here. Something has happened already. And I think someone's trying to overcome this problem, fix this problem, which I feel like you've, this has been an ongoing reading for Capricorn. I, I'm not sure what's the deal, um, Capricorn, but I feel like this is somebody that, you know, and, and in November, your reading was about someone wanting a second chance and i feel like this could be the same person i'm trying to figure out why they're still around two of wands is here with this five of swords reverse and the chariot oh my goodness cancer energy capricorn when i saw this chariot i saw oh no <laughs> it's i heard it but i saw it oh no Almost like they show up, but it's maybe not welcomed. Or they show up and something goes wrong. I feel like this is someone headed towards you. Um, and quickly, the chariot, 
Knight of Swords. It's like they, they're coming to say their peace. Uh, Eight of Wands reverse at the bottom of the deck. The Hangman. So there's like um like a block here. There's the Knight of Pentacles reversed again. So I find this. Ooh. Of course I draw my card. I find this pretty fascinating. I won't lie because we have the Knight of Swords and the and the Chariot very quick, and then the Eight of Wands is the opposite reverses the opposite of that. It's like the breaks. And the hangman's not moving. And neither is the Knight of Pentacles reverse. So <laughs> it's almost like they're they could be rushing in and you're like standing still. You're like, I, I'm fine right here. I don't need to rush anywhere. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm picking up so far. So it's almost like it's it's like spirit wants me to know that you maybe are not on the same page here. But why? What happened? Something happened because the five of wands is reversed and the five of swords is reversed. So something definitely happened here. Okay, let's get your energies between you and this person. I'm going to have your um, energies on one side, your person's on the other. Uh, but feel free to flip them Capricorn if they resonate more for you. Spirit, tell me about the energies between Capricorn and this person they are thinking about or connecting with at this time. What are the energies between Capricorn and their person? What are the energies? Capricorn and their person. Pure seduction, cold shoulder. Yeah, you're trying to block this person. I feel like you're trying to keep them at bay. Oops. Um, you're trying to keep them at bay, but maybe it's 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 hard because I think a part of you is still interested um, or a part of you is still attracted to this person. Yeah, you're trying to um, keep your cool is kind of what I'm getting here. Tell me about this other person. Tell me about this other person. I think you've cut off communication. Some of you have cut off communication like completely. You don't want any drama. You want peace. Past life, poetic justice. Yeah, this person definitely wants to fix the past. Paralyzing fear and then deep regret at the bottom of the deck. I think this person is really scared of you moving on without them or i um, scared that they have screwed up and can't repair this. And I would be scared too if I was dealing with you and you were in this energy. What else? What else can you tell me? crocodile and golden egg i think the the only reason that you even look might look in this person's direction is that you just want to know the truth there's something that you still are trying to like figure out about this person and it's almost like a, a part of you wants to know the truth but another part of you is like i don't want to know anything besides that and if i open up this this door i'm going to get a whole bunch more than just the truth yeah the oyster on their side they kept something from you and I think you know it and you want them to just tell you. I think this person might tell you, but it's out of fear. It's not because, you know, they really want to be open and transparent. I think it's because they're scared to lose you. Get some more insight, please. For Capricorn. What does Capricorn need to know? About this person, this connection. What does Capricorn need to know? I feel like I want to flip some of these up, which is kind of weird because I already shuffled. Okay, tell me, tell me more for Capricorn. Okay, tell me more for Capricorn. One more, please. Okay, Capricorn. You have the Three of Swords and the Six of Swords. I mean, right away, this is, 
problems, problems here because I feel like you were hurt and you left or are leaving. Um, three of Wands reverse. I feel like with the Three of Wands reverse, Two of Pentacles reverse here, and the Five of Pentacles reverse. Hmm. I'm sensing like a uh, frustration. Frustration. You're frustrated, but why? Frustration with an impatience. There's the fool. What's going on? What's going on here? Oh my god, of course I drop it. Hang on. Try to catch it with my eye and I couldn't. What's going on here? Tell me about this three of wands and the two of pentacles reversed. The magician. Yeah, you want to get something done. You want to do something. Three of Pentacles reverse and then the Tower. I feel like you unfortunately need something from this person for you to move forward. I don't know if that's hearing the truth from them. I don't know if that's money. I don't know if that's their assistance in some way. But I feel like you're frustrated because you want to get something done and like just, you know, you've already made your decision about something, but you're kind of like stuck here. Yeah, Ace of Wands reverse. You're kind of stuck here, and I think I think you need something from this person. But I don't see you. I don't see you being like interested in this person. You know, unfortunately for this person, I feel like you're only still here because you need something from them. Kind of. Yeah. This. Just the moon. I always confuse this one with the star. I think this is the moon. Yeah. This is the moon reverse. Pisces energy. So I feel that you already know something but need confirmation or you were you received clarity about something, the truth about something, and you were ready to leave but you can't for whatever reason. That's kind of what I'm picking up for you. I think you're trying to keep your cool because you need to. I don't know what this is. If you're married to this person, that would make a lot of sense, actually. You would need them to work with you for a divorce, for example. Or if you're moving out somewhere, you might need them to help you with that or something like that. Tell me about the person Capricorn is dealing with. What do we need to know about them? About them. Five of Cups. Ten of Pentacles reverse. Six of Cups reverse. Well, they're not doing great. They're not doing great. Five of Cups, Regrets, and there's the Queen of Swords with the Knight of Swords reverse. Interesting. Regrets, past, um, past, um, the past is disappointing or they're having disappointment or experiencing disappointment. Ten of Pentacles reverse is somebody that is, their, their stability has been rocked. Um, they might be feeling unstable. They might be having financial difficulties, a broken commitment perhaps. And Six of Cups reverse, typically it's a card about um, bad memories, um, a past that's not so sweet, um, a delayed, um, well, it's really more about like uh, memories that turn bad or um, something like that. Sometimes it can mean returning to the past. This person's not doing so well though. Ten of Pentacles reverse kind of sucks. And then we have it with the Five of Cups. Tell me about this Five of Cups. What do we need to know about this Five of Cups. Yeah. Temperance reverse. Sagittarius energy. So they're they're not dealing well with what's happening right now. They are not okay. They might feel like, you know, things are off balance unstable and this person doesn't like that or isn't doing well with that yeah tower the tower happened here 
So they might have caused it. Yeah, they're not doing good, this person. What else do we need to know? Eight of Wands reverse, yep. This person I feel is stuck. King of Pentacles, the lovers. Interesting. Page of Wands reverse. Interesting. I don't know. Um, it could be that this person, okay, some of you, and this isn't going to resonate with all of you, but I'm picking this up for some of you. Uh, this person depends on you for something, and so you can't get rid of them easily. Um, again, I feel like some of you could be married to this person because I feel it's a very strong tie here. This could be a financial tie. Some of you, for example, can't break a lease without this person. Yeah, and this person is using this um, tie to their advantage. They're going to try to apologize, wear you down during this process. Um, they could feel, I mean, I'm not saying that their feelings are not genuine, um, but it's almost like it's it's almost like I, I have to use this time to, you know, fix things. Because as soon as this tie is no longer um, a part of us, or as soon as this tie is gone, I will lose Capricorn for good. It's kind of what I'm picking up here. Yeah, and I, I think what happened is that um, this person could have lied to you or um, played you in some way where it's like it's really hard for you to forgive them. Whatever it was, I think it's really hard for you to forgive them. Yeah, the hermit. I think you 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 literally did, uh, separated yourself from this person or like I feel like you're very far from this person or have put this person in, you know, very far from you. Created some sort of boundary here. What else can you tell me about this other person? What else can you tell me about this other person? I also see here that you could have figured out the truth and it hurt because you had to find out that way. Um, it was like the worst way you could have found out. What else do we need to know about this other person? What else do we need to know? I wonder if you are happy without me. So many things remind me of you. Yeah, I think you, you, you probably left or something. We will be together again at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, they don't want to let you go, Capricorn. Um, I think this is just a continuation of that other person, the other reading that I did um, where they, they didn't want to let you go. And I don't know if I wrote that in the title, but that was the November reading and also, yeah, I think it was the November reading. Hmm. Can I get one more for this person? Can I get one more for this other person, please? Courtship. Yeah, start over. Bad health. This is where they are at. They're hoping that they can have a do-over with you. Main female, mature man, lovers. Yeah. How can I fix this? I mean, unfortunately, Capricorn, I don't think a lot of you care. <laughs> I mean, I, I feel like that sounds bad. But I think you're just ready to cut this out of your life um because i don't sense from you i sense more impatience and frustration you know than i i just don't see you being feel feel you being receptive i feel like you you would love to hear the truth from this person but i think it's because in your mind you deserve at least that it's not because you really want to hear from them um, of course, I could be wrong about that, Capricorn. Everybody's different, and every situation is different. But for the Capricorns I'm hearing, I'm reading for today, that's the majority of you I'm feeling this for. Um, so that's what I have for you, for the uh, you and them. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the reading. Hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more readings from me. And I'll see you all in another video very soon. Take care.